people, it's Temi if you're new here and it's time for another studio vlog. So today I'm so excited. I've got my brand new camera. I've been saving up for too long and I will be unboxing that a little later. But first I need to finish filming a video. So at the moment I use my phone and I just need to finish filming a video that I'm trying to put out tomorrow. And then we'll do some unboxing. I will play around with the camera a little later on. Just finished filming and look at the state of my desk. If you want to see this video, I'll link it up in the cards. Now time to tidy up. One of the things I love the most about using colour pencils is the quick cleanup process. Compared to paints where you have to be washing brushes, I just love that I can just put these back together and it's all good. And I also love putting them back in some sort of good enough order. I don't like messing up the colour range, but it also doesn't need to be perfect, you know? the next day okay so it's the day after i've got my coffee and please don't mind my nails so i need to do it today and i started popping it off but um i'm so sorry for another day also on my to-do list i need to edit a video that's coming out today by the time you're watching this the video will be out so using children's coloring books and making professional art something like that so that video will be out and i need to edit that today i'll show you the behind the scenes of that and then a little later on we'll play around with the new camera we'll also use it to film and see what that's looking like and then maybe we'll get these nails done <laughs> yeah it should be a super productive day today i also have cramps and i'm sure women you can relate or people the menstruate i'm sure you can relate I have cramps so I'm also not trying to beat myself up too much about how much I can do today and how productive I'm being today. So we'll just see how today goes. My number one priority for the day is to get this video done and get the video out. Okay, editing time. And my editing process is pretty easy. I just chop up the footage and I also use my notes app to write my script for my voiceover. I know you might think it all sounds natural when I'm talking in my voiceover, but I have to write up everything that I'm thinking of saying as I'm watching it so that I don't miss anything out. And of course I try to put my own snippets here and there. For example, this is a snippet that wasn't written down. And I also color correct to try to get the colors looking as close to real life as possible. And yeah, that's my editing process, chopping bits up, speeding some bits up, making sure I cut off the bits where the camera's moving, this and that, and now it's time for voiceover. I don't own any children's coloring books, but a while ago, Color Noir app reached out to me on Instagram to see if I wanted to download their free e-coloring book. And I thought, why not? I love a freebie. <laughs> And now I'm just finishing my voiceover and this is what the timeline is looking like after I've done all my voiceover and cut everything up and just left the relevant bits. So now it's time to find music. Guys, I'm finally done. Oh, this video took so long, a hundred million years later. We're finally seeing the finish line. It is 10 minutes to 6 p.m. So I need to hurry up, pick the music, put it all together, watch it once, export, and hope you'll like it. I'll show you how I find my music. For my music, I use a website called Epidemic Sound, and it's a website you can get free copyright, free music. Video is not sponsored, but I'll leave a link below if you want to check it out. You can get, I think your first month free if you use my link. But what's good about it, it has like recommendations for my YouTube channel. And usually those are things that are around my vibes. So I just play some of them. <laughs> I feel like I've already downloaded this. See, this will be nice for like a studio vlog. So I'll keep that for the future. Because of the vibe of this video, I'm like being energetic. Maybe this could work. I don't know. Happy and hopeful. I'll download it anyway. So she's giving me studio vlog. This is 
giving me let's just chill it's giving studio vlog so yeah this is how i find my music i think i might actually use this happy one it's a bit too happy for me though <laughs> i don't know that i like that okay i'm gonna put it in i also need to do a quick parametric effect Hey people, it's Temi if you're new here and I'm coming at you with something a little bit different today. So I've seen this kind of video going around on YouTube where you just colour in a children's colouring book as a professional artist. My normal style is more realistic and I wanted to try my realistic style but obviously with a cartoony drawing. So with that, let's go! Okay, I'm not mad at that. I don't own any I'm not mad at that, so that's what we're going to use, okay? So let's finish this up. It is 6pm. Let us finish this and... I don't even know what. Let's just finish this and get this video up because this is taking too long. So I finally finished editing this video. It's eight o'clock. I need to stop doing my last minute thing because I'm going to now upload it now and it's so late. And it'll probably take at least 40 something minutes to upload. So the earliest this video is getting up is nine o'clock tonight, but that's my own fault. So you'd have noticed my nails are back on. I quickly glued them back on because today has been long already. I will not have the time to do new nails today. It'll have to be one evening during the week or maybe next weekend. But I thought while my video is uploading, I've grabbed a glass of wine and let's do this camera unboxing. I'm going to play around with the camera, see what we can do with it and end the vlog. So this wine, my friend got it for me. It's a Greek wine and it's so good. If you like white wine, you should definitely try this one. If you can get it, because actually, <laughs> I don't know what country you're in. You might not be able to get it, but it's still good. Oh my god, Ugh, I'm even scared. Oh my god, it's not a PG film branded. <laughs> okay, and here is what the new camera is looking like. It's got this flip out screen that twists and this is one of the main reasons I actually ended up going up with this one. And here is everything that comes in the box and honestly, I don't know what half of these items are but I guess we'll figure it out together, right? But I'm just happy that I'm able to upgrade to a camera. I've been using my phone to film for the past nearly two years of doing YouTube properly, full time. And by full time, I mean like a couple videos a week, not full, full, full time, because I've still got my full time job. But anyway, here is the lens that came with the set. So it is the 18 to 55 millimeter one. And I actually wanted the 16 to 18 millimeter, but it was out of stock by the time I was ready to actually put the money down. Because trust me, this camera is not cheap. If you're a newbie and you're looking to me for equipment, don't buy this camera. <laughs> I've been saving up for a long time. But yeah, I'm just excited that I'm finally able to upgrade from my phone. So with the camera, oh. I'm so excited like this just feels like it feels a bit surreal yeah if I'm going to be honest the fact that I can actually start to use this but yeah let's play around with it where is the instruction manual because not gonna break it owner's manual not gonna lie the gen z and me just wants to find a youtube video of someone showing me because who is reading this book a few moments later the very start of the video as well as links to anything that i talk about during this video i'm um, finally before we begin just a word confusion this video is not me going through every single menu item on this camera it's Like, is this thing, is that it? I don't know. I don't know that this is properly on, you know, because it's too easy. 
Ugh, guys, I'm stressed. Oh my god. Twenty minutes later. Oh, it clicked. It clicked. It clicked. Okay, now I feel like that's secure and I'm happy about that. I have no clue what settings to use. I don't even know what I'm looking for. <laughs> I think it's going to take me a while to get used to using this camera. And if you use the X-T4 or any Fujifilm, leave a comment or DM me on Instagram. I'd love to get some tips. But I'm just going to practice taking some shots and let's just see what this camera can do. Look at some of the pictures I just took. I mean, I've definitely got a long way to go, but... Yeah, guys, I'm not going to lie to you. This is also exciting. And just being able to invest in myself, invest in my business is such a blessing. So first and foremost, I'm grateful to God. But also thank you guys for all your support because your support helped me so much. You don't even understand. And I'm hoping that with this upgrade, you will see a level up for my quality, maybe some 4K videos. <laughs> well, first I need to figure out how to use this camera. But get ready because the quality is about to level up. But till then, please like, please subscribe and I'll see you on my next one. Goodbye.